randomly do around the house to help with your arms. You know, because sometimes we all don't have these. And most of the times we don't have these. And I know a lot of people don't have one of these. A pull-up bar up in their house. I am special enough to have it because of my husband. So just some random things you can do is use your counter to do push-ups. So you don't have to be getting down on the floor. Do everything the same way. Just make sure your back is straight, your arms are out good, and use the push-up. Some other things that you can do is you can use your pet, so to say. Come here, Charlie. Sometimes they might not like this, but you can also just bring them up. Let's try it this way. Let's try it this way. See? <laughs> I know you didn't like it very much. Another thing I like to do is sometimes I use my children. And I can't show you a good example because they are asleep right now, but I just hold my arms out like this, and then we just put their arms over and then I just lift them up like this. Easy to do. Sometimes they really enjoy it. Some other things besides like working your arms out with weights is, of course, you can totally stretch your arms with the original stretches across the arms. Another one I like is over the head, but I like to hold my hand and pull over. Same with the other side. Then another thing I learned because I hurt my shoulder and the therapist taught me is, you know, you have your feet shoulder width apart, good amount away from the wall. And you just hold your arms up like this and you push on the wall and you just stretch as much as you can. You can do the same thing with put your hands in a triangle and do the same thing in the stretch. There you go. There are some household things you can do or use or <laughs> even your children and your pets, like I said, to help with your arms on a daily basis to get them worked out. See you guys later.